Okay guys, this is the solution for your exercise, page 131a. Question number 6, uh, line y plus x equals to 0 is translated by uh, negative 1 and 2. So I can tell you that this one is the original and then the transformation is translation. That means we will use the formula of the translation like this one, negative 1 and 2 for the translation that means uh, because the question wants you to find the image we have to move this one to the left hand side so you have x prime y prime minus with negative 1 and 2 equals to x and y and then calculate it you have uh, x prime plus 1 and then y prime minus 2 equals to x and y and then after this you have to put the value of x and also the value of y we have the value of x equals to x prime plus 1 and then the value of the y equals to y prime minus 2 okay so we have the original line the original line is y plus x equals to 0 and then for the image you only have to replace the value of x and the value of y <coughs> um, this one will be y prime minus 2 and then plus the x is x prime plus 1 equals to 0 so x prime plus y prime minus 1 equals to 0 that also means y plus x equals to 1 the answer is A. Next is question number 7. The image of line uh, 5x minus 6y plus 30 equals to 0. So this one is the original. And then the transformation is translation. That means x prime y prime equals to x and y plus 10 negative 5. Because the question wants you to find the image, that means I have to move this one. So you will have x prime minus 10 and then y prime plus 5 equals to x and y. From this one we have the value of x, x equals to x prime minus 10 and then from this one I will have the value of y, y equals to y prime plus 5. Okay good. Next is to find the image, the original line is 5x minus 6y plus 30 equals to 0 and then uh, the image the image will be 5 times the x minus 6 times the y and then plus 30 equals to 0 the x is x prime minus 10 and the y is y prime plus 5 and then you simplify it 5x prime minus 50 minus 6y prime minus 30 plus 30 equals to 0 you can cross out this one it means 5x minus 6y minus 50 equals to 0 and the answer is a next is question number nine uh, the image of the parabola after the translation t equals to 6 and negative 10 so this one is the original we have to find the image later x prime y prime equals to x y plus the translation 6 negative 10 and then i will have to move this one to the left hand side because the image is us that means we have to find the value of x and y plus 10 right here equals to x and y that means we have x equals to x prime minus 6 and then we have y equals to y prime plus 10 okay next is to find the image the original is y equals to x square plus 4x plus 13 and then the image is um, the y is y prime plus 10 and then equal to x square plus 4 times x plus 13 
so the x is x prime minus 6 this one also x prime minus 6 simplify it x prime sorry y prime plus 10 equals to x square minus 12 x plus 36 let's remove the prime um, so we will not have to uh, write it anymore plus 13 and then y equals 2 x square and then this one is negative 8 x and then this one is 26 26 minus 24 is 2 plus 13 equals to 15 so the answer is D next is question number 10 page 131 a given that y equals 2 to x square minus 12 x plus 17 this one is the original and then the uh, image is already given right here and the question wants you to find the um, translation so let's write down the chart for translation it's like this this one is a and b yeah, because the translation is a and b this time i will uh, find the value of uh, x prime and y prime instead of um, x and y yeah but if you want uh, to find the x and y you can do it also okay i do this uh, because when i trying to find the x prime you don't have to uh, move the a and b so it will become uh, shorter x plus a and then the y prime will be y plus b okay because we already have the value of x prime and y prime let's start from the image because i have the image as y equals to 2x square plus 4x plus 3 that means this one is the image so i can add prime right there because image means prime right then i will try to find the original by replacing the y prime and also the x prime so the y prime is um, y plus b equals to 2 times the x prime plus 4 times the x prime plus 3 the x prime is x plus a this one also x plus a okay let's simplify it you have x y plus b equals to 2 times this one is x square plus ax plus ax that means plus 2 ax and then the last one is a square still in the brackets this one we can multiply the 4 so 4x plus 4a and then plus 3 <coughs> okay i will move the b uh, but right now i want to multiply this one first so 2x square plus 4ax plus 2a square plus 4x plus 4a plus 3 and then i will move the b so i will have minus b right here okay i think this oh let's rearrange so we can see the x clearly uh, plus 4x and then the one without x also just like this okay so this is our original in term of a and b the original is already given like um, 2x square and then minus 12x and then plus 17 that means we can compare it 2x square is already the same that means we have to compare this one 4ax plus 4x have to be equal to negative 12 so i can tell that 4a plus 4 have to be equal to negative 12 so 4a equals to negative 16 a equals to negative 4 there you go and then the next one 2a square plus 4a plus 3 minus b have to be equal to 17 so this with this one have to be the same <coughs> because we already know the value of a we can replace it like this plus 4 times negative 4 plus 3 minus b equals to 17 and then you only have to calculate this one is 16 times 2 is 32 
uh, this one is minus 16 plus 3 minus b equals to 17 that means uh, 16 plus 3 is 19 minus b equals to 17 so b equals to 2 <coughs> am i right yes okay so a equals to uh, negative 4 b equals to 2 that means a minus b equals to negative 4 minus 2 equals to negative 6 the answer is a Next is page 143b, question number 3. The image of line 2x plus 3y plus 6 equals to 0. That means this one is the original. And then the question says uh, reflection to the line x equals to 3. That means the formula will be like this. x prime minus a and then y prime equals to um, x, yeah x equals 2 that means negative 1 0 0 1 times it with um, x and y and then minus a okay so what is the value of a a equals to 3 so you can replace this with 3 and replace this with 3 also and then just multiply the um, matrix so you have negative x plus 3 and also y okay so right now we already have x prime minus 3 equals to negative x plus 3 i will trying to find the value of x that means i will move this negative x to the left hand side and then i will move this two to the right hand side yeah so i will have x equal to um negative x prime and then 3 plus 3 equals to 6 okay so this is the value of x and then the value of y will be x prime the next thing is to find the image so i have the original uh, line the original line is that. the original line is 2x plus 3y plus 6 equals to 0 and then i can find the image by substituting the value of x and also the value of y the value of x is x sorry negative x prime plus 6 and then the value of y is y prime okay simplify it negative 2x plus 12 plus 3y plus 6 equals to 0 that means negative 2x plus 3y equals to negative 18 and then you multiply them all by negative 1 so you have to x minus 3y equals to 18 to x minus 3y equals to 18 the answer is e next is question number four the question give you the original line and then the transformation is reflection to the y-axis that means x prime y prime equals to y axis that means 1 0 0 negative 1 sorry y axis yeah negative 1 0 0 1 times it with x and y because the question wants you to find the x and y that means eh, uh, because the question wants you to find the image that means you have to find the value of x and y so you just multiply the matrix you will have negative x and also y that means from the first you will have x prime equals to negative x that means x equals to negative x prime and then the second is the y y equals to y prime okay good next is to find the image the original is um, 3x minus y minus 7 equals to 0 that means the image is 3 times minus y minus 7 equals to 0 so y first it will become y prime then x it will become negative x so i will have negative 3x minus y minus 7 equals to 0 oh wait something's wrong mm, right here let me check okay all is correct but to get the answer you have to multiply this one with negative one 
so it will become positive for all of them 3x plus y plus 7 equals to 0 and the answer is b then page 143b question number 5 this one is the original and then y equals to x ya so x prime y prime y equal to x is 0 1 1 0 times it with x and y we multiply them you have y and also x right there and then if we separate the value of x and y you will have x equals to y prime and then you will have y equals to x prime okay so the original is um, 2x plus y minus 3 equals to 0 that means the image is 2 times the x plus y and then minus 3 equals to 0 the x is y prime the y is x prime it means when we simplify it you will have 2y plus x minus 3 equals to 0 uh, the answer is a next is question number 6 the image of line 2x plus y minus 1 equals to 0 so i think this one is the original the transformation is x axis and then y axis yeah. so the formula will be x prime y prime equals to we have two matrix right here we can use composition because um, there is no um, minus a minus b yeah. so this one is x and y first is the x axis x axis will be right here and then the second one is the y axis y axis will be right there okay y axis is um, negative 1 negative 1 0 0 and 1 and then x axis is 1 0 0 negative 1 okay let's multiply it you have negative 1 right here and then 0 0 and negative 1 x and 1 okay let's multiply it again so the result is negative x and negative y and then let's try to find the x and y from this one we have x prime equals to negative x that means x equals to negative x prime so this is the first and then the second one is from this one uh, y prime equals to negative y that means y equals to negative y prime okay next is to find the image the original the original line is 2x plus y minus 1 equals to 0 and then we are trying to find the image how to do it just replace the value of x and the value of y the value of x is uh, sorry the value of x is negative x prime and the value of y is negative y prime so the final answer is negative 2x prime minus y prime minus 1 equals to 0 but there is no uh, options like this that means we have to multiply them all by negative 1 the result the final result is 2x plus y plus 1 equals to 0 which is b next is 7 for number 7 i have original for this one and then i have the image this one and then reflection through x equals to k that means x prime minus a oh sorry minus a here to y prime equals to x equals to that means uh, negative 1 0 0 1 times it with x y and then minus a because the a is k that means i can replace the a with k like this and then you only have to simplify x prime y prime minus k equals to negative x plus k for this one and then this one is y and then we separate the elements 
we have x prime minus k equals to a negative x plus k but we are trying to find the f that means i will remove this to uh, not remove okay, move the move the negative x to the left hand side and then i will move this two to the left hand side so x equals to negative x prime plus 2k okay next is the y y prime equals to y that means y equals to y prime there you go because it wants you to find all the bed mm, oh no no that's fine that's fine okay so uh, we have the original sorry the original is y equals to x square minus 4x plus 3 and then uh, because we already have the x and y let's try to find the um, image okay so the image will be um, y and then x square minus 4 times x and then plus 3 yeah. we only have to replace the value of y and the value of x the value of y is y prime and then the value of x is um, negative x prime plus 2k negative x prime plus 2k yeah let's simplify it y prime equals to um, x square minus 2 minus 2 minus 4 k x and then plus 4 k square and then this one is plus 4 x minus 8 k plus 3 okay um let's rearrange it a little bit like x square and then negative 4 k x plus 4 x and then plus 4 k square minus 8 k and then plus 3 okay so this is the image and also we already have the image in the questions which is um, y equals to x square minus 8 x and then plus 15 that means we can conclude that this one have to be equal to negative 8 negative 4k sorry without x yeah negative 4k plus 4 equals to negative 8 and that also means um, negative 4k equals to negative 12 so k equals to 3 there you go we already have the value of k which is 3 so the second uh, comparison is not used yeah this one is not used we already have the key next is page 151b uh, the image of line um, so this one is original after it is rotated clockwise 90 degree so the angle is 90 degree clockwise that means we can uh, put the value directly in our um, formula later yeah. and then this one is the a and the b the center so the formula will be like this minus a minus b that means minus 3 and minus 1 minus 3 and minus 1 the angle is cos alpha sorry cos theta negative sine theta sine theta and then cos theta <coughs> okay let's calculate it so x prime minus 3 y prime minus 1 equals to 0 negative 1 1 0 multiply it with x minus 3 and y minus 1 let's multiply the matrix equals to um, negative y plus 1 and then this one is x minus 3 and then we can uh, separate the elements we have x prime minus 3 equals to negative y plus 1 we move the negative y and then we move this two yeah so y equals to negative x prime plus 1 plus 3 equals to 4 and then for the second one we can say that y prime minus 1 equals to x minus 3 that means x equals to y prime plus 2 okay we already have the value of x and y it's time for us to find the image the original line is y equals to 3x plus 7 that means the image will be 
negative x I'm sorry the y the y is negative x prime plus 4 and then equal to 3 times the x and then later plus 7 the x is y prime plus 2 okay let's simplify it negative x plus 4 equals to 3y plus 6 plus 7 and then negative x minus 3y equals to sorry move it to the left ya uh, 13 minus 9 equals to 0 there is no option for this uh, answer so we multiply them all by negative 1 and the answer is D okay next is question number 5 uh, the image of line y plus 2 square root of 2x plus square root of 2 that means this one is the original and then the transformation is rotation but this time it's clockwise so I have to change the angle first by um, subtract it with um, 360 so I will have 45 degree counterclockwise we will use this later in our chart so x prime y prime equals to uh, cos negative sine sine cos and then xy because the center is 0 0 we don't have to write down the a and b uh, and that means we only have to calculate the angle cos 45 negative sine 45 sine 45 and also cos 45 so x prime y prime equals to cos 45 is square root of 2 over 2 minus square root of 2 over 2 square root 2 over 2 this one is square root 2 over 2 times it with x and y okay this one will be a little bit hard because to find the value of of x and y we have to use inverse matrix so I have to move this matrix to the left hand side uh, the formula is 1 over determinant determinant for uh, determinant is this times this minus this times that so this times this first square root of 2 times square root of 2 is 2 2 times 2 is 4 that means the result is 2 over 4 and then you have to minus it with the next one the next one is the same but the sign is negative 2 over 4 okay and then you have to write down the adjoin the adjoin is to switch this one not switch a swap and then I give negative sign to the remaining this one is positive this one is negative times it with x prime y prime equals to x and y okay so this one equals to 1 so I don't have to rewrite it anymore we only have to multiply this with that one so I will have square root of 2 over 2 x prime plus square root 2 over 2 y prime and then the next one will be negative square root of 2 over 2 x prime plus square root 2 over 2 y prime equals to x and y there you go we already have the value of x and y it's time for us to find the image so what is the original the original is y equals to square root of 2 x plus square root of 2 and yeah, that means the image will be like this image we um, substitute the value of x and also the y yeah. the x is um, square root of 2 over 2 x prime plus square root of 2 over 2 y prime and then the y is negative square root of 2 over 2 x prime plus square root 2 over 2 y prime okay So we only have to multiply this I think negative 2 sorry negative square root of 2 over 2 x prime plus square root of 2 over 2 y prime equals to this one is 1 x square eh, sorry 1 x and then this one let's remove the prime yeah this one is 1 x that one is 1 y 
plus square root of 2 and then we times them all by 2 to remove the denominator negative square root of 2x plus square root of 2y equal to 2x plus 2y plus 2 square root of 2 and then the option is y equal to yeah so we have to make it into y equal to sorry i don't know like it like it yeah <coughs> so next is to isolate the y because we have square root of 2y right there and then 2y right here that means i have to remove this one so square root of 2y minus 2y equals 2 and then i will move this one to the right hand side um, 2x plus 2 square root of 2x and then plus 2 square root of 2 okay i can factorize the y the remaining is square root of 2 minus 2 equals 2 and then for this one i will uh, factorize the x also plus 2 square root of 2 and then i will move the 2 plus square root of 2x i will move the um, square root of 2 minus 2 plus 2 square root of 2 over square root of 2 minus 2 okay and then we have to um, simplify it we have 2 plus square root of 2 square root of 2 minus 2 that means we have to rationalize it uh, by multiplying with the akar kawan ya this one okay let's uh, multiply this 2 square root of 2 this one is plus 4 this one is plus 4 this one is plus 4 square root of 2 over this one is 2 this one is minus 4 so i uh, will have um, 8 plus 6 square root of 2 over negative 2 that means negative 4 minus 3 square root of 2 so the x will be that one negative 4 negative 3 square root of 2 x and then for this one let me erase it first 2 square root of 2 over square root of 2 minus 2 times it with the akar sekawan this one and then you multiply it this one is 4 this one is plus 4 square root of 2 over 2 minus 4 so plus 4 2, 4 plus 4 square root of 2 over negative 2 that means negative 2 minus 2 square root of 2 so this one is negative 2 minus 2 square root of 2 okay let's see if the options right there hopefully oh no we have to um factorize the negative Wait. oh no something's wrong maybe yeah let me check oh no i made a mistake right here yeah so it should be uh, square root of two only this one also and this one also and then the result will be okay, let me calculate okay so the result is negative 3 minus 2 square root of 2 okay my bad <coughs> and then uh, the next thing you have to do is to um, factorize the negative so negative times 3 plus 2 square root of 2 x and then this one also 2 plus 2 square root of 2 there you go let's see the option and the correct answer is a next is question number seven the image of a parabola y equals to x square that means this one is the original after it is rotated by 180 degree that means this one is the theta and then about the point is the center a and b Okay, let's write down the formula. X prime y prime, and then a b, and then cos negative sine, sine and cos. For 180 degree, uh, it is not important whether it is um, 
clockwise or counterclockwise yeah, because it's the same it's 180 degree so minus a is minus 2 minus b is negative 3 minus 2 minus 3 and then the angle is 180 degree just like this <coughs> okay and then simplify it a little bit y prime minus 3 equals to cos 180 equals to negative 1 this one is 0 0 and negative 1 times it with x minus 2 and also y minus 3 okay let's multiply the matrix you will have negative x plus 2 and then negative y plus 3 right there and then for this one x prime minus 2 y prime minus 3 and then you will uh, move the negative x and negative y to the left hand side you have x prime minus 2 for this one equals to negative x plus 2 I will move the negative x to the left hand side so I will have x equals to negative x prime plus 4 and then from the y we have y prime minus 3 equals to negative y plus 3 I will move the negative y to the left hand side y equals to negative y prime plus 6 okay this is the value of x and y next is to find the image the original is um, y equals to x square minus 4x plus 7 it means the image will be wait let me write it first okay the y the y replace with negative y prime plus 6 and the x replaced by negative x prime plus 4 negative x prime plus 4 and then you only have to simplify x square minus 8x plus 16 plus 4x minus 16 plus 7 so negative y equals to x square minus 4x plus 7 minus 6 negative y equals to x square minus 4x plus 1 you multiply them all by negative 1 so y equals to negative x square plus 4x minus 1 there you go and the answer is um, d next is uh, 162a uh, question number 5 the image of parabola after it is okay so this one is the original this time the um, transformation is dilation that means x prime y prime minus a minus b is zero so we don't have to write it um, the k the formula is k zero zero k for the dilation and the k is negative one over four negative one over four okay so we only have to multiply the matrix we will have negative 1 over 4x and negative 1 over 4y and then from the x you will have the value negative sorry let me write it down first negative 1 over 4x and then i will move this negative 1 over 4 to the left hand side that means i have to multiply it with negative 4 negative 4x prime equals to x and then the second one is the same so I will have y equals to negative 4y prime and then let's try to find the image the original is y equals to x square minus 4x plus 7 and then the image the image is plus 7 Okay, the x is negative 4x prime negative 4x prime and the y is negative 4y prime and then we have to simplify it this one is 16x square and then plus 16x and then plus 7 that means y prime equals to negative 4x square negative 4x negative 7 over 4 oh no Hmm. Wait, let me check it first oh my god my bad the i typed the question wrong should be 
x square minus 10x ya bebet bebet x square minus 10x so this one is minus 10 we double 7 that means this one is positive 40x and then you divide by negative 4 negative 10x okay so this is the answer which is d the next is question number 4 given that x plus 3y equals to 38 is the original the image of line eh wait oh this one is the image sorry this one is the this one is the image this one is the original line ya yeah. uh, direction k the k is the yeah k and then the 5 5 is ab okay so we have x prime y prime minus a minus b later and then k 0 0 k times it with the x and y the a b is negative 5 negative 5 negative 5 negative 5 and then the k is k uh, let's simplify it a bit i think we can multiply the k ya yeah. so x prime minus 5 y prime minus 5 equals to um, k x minus 5k and then that one will be k y minus 5k and then for this one i will try to find the x prime y prime that means i will move the negative 5 to the left hand to the right hand side k x minus 5k plus 5 for the x prime and then this one is k y minus k minus 5k plus 5 <coughs> okay next is to compare the image and also the um, original because we are we already have the value of x prime and y prime that means we will start from the image the image is x prime plus 3y prime equals to 38 remember when you have image you can put prime uh, above the x and also the y to um, notice uh, not to notice yet to uh, to suppose that that one is the image yeah and then the original to find the original of course we only have to replace the value of x prime and also the y prime later x prime plus 3 times the y prime equals to 38 when we um, replace the x prime it will be kx minus 5k oh no plus 5 and then plus 3 times the y prime the y prime is ky minus 5k plus 5 and then equals to 38 okay let's simplify this one <coughs> So kx minus 5k plus 5 plus 3ky minus 15k plus 15 equals to 38 and then um, kx right here and then plus 3ky right there I think this is more than enough because we are can compare it already eh wait that is not the image ya the original the original is x plus 3y plus blah 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 we don't need the blah 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 because we can compare this directly so k okay, equals to 1 <coughs> wait there is no 1 no what's wrong oh this one is a little bit tricky ya yeah? so we cannot compare the value of x and compare the value of y because maybe maybe this one is the simplification of the line ya yeah? let's try to find the value of k using the constant negative 15 k and then this one is plus 20 minus 38 equals to 0 oh equals to 29 yeah. so I better 
move this to the right hand side equals to sorry let's forget about this one 38 plus 15k plus sorry minus 15 and then minus 5 yeah. okay so this one is negative 20 18 18 plus 15k kx plus 3k1 and then the original is x plus 3y equals to 29 x plus 3y equals to 29 that means 29 equals to 18 plus 15k oh my god what happened oh i forgot this plus negative 5k yeah so this one is plus 5k 20k i think this one should be 28 so the k equals to half oh no i have no idea for this one yeah let's um, discuss about this later in class next is page 165a uh, question number three the image of line this one is the original the transformation is translation twice that means you only have to add the x and y twice yeah seven one and also one seven the order is not important so you can write down one seven first also this one is x plus eight this one is y plus eight and then i will move the 8 to the left hand side so i will have x prime minus 8 equals to x for this one uh, y prime minus 8 equals to y and then find the image the original is um, 3x minus 2y plus 12 equals to 0 and the image will be 3 times the x minus 2 times the y plus 12 equals to 0 the x is x prime minus 8 the y is y prime minus 8 so simplify it 24 minus 2y plus 16 plus 12 equals to 0 <coughs> that means 3x minus 2y minus 8 plus 12 plus 4 equals to 0 yeah oh sorry eh, yeah. See, it's like plus 4 right oh no oh okay, okay okay so you only have to multiply them all by negative 1 negative 3x plus 2y minus 4 equals to 0 it's b Okay, next is question number 5, uh, page 165a. Given that y equals to 3x squared minus 25x plus 60 is the image. So, this one is the image. This one is the image. And the other one is the original. And then the transformation is translation. That means uh, we only have to add the x and y with the translation. A2 plus negative 2 and b okay, let's simplify the matrix i will have x plus a minus 2 and then y plus b plus 2 okay so this is our x prime and y prime uh, because we already have the x prime and y prime that means we will start from the image the image is y prime equals to 3x prime square minus 25 x prime and then plus 60 and then if we substitute the <coughs> y prime and x prime we will have the original that means this one is y plus b plus 2 equals to 3 times the x the x is x plus a minus 2 and then square minus 25 times the x is x plus a minus 2 and then plus 60 okay let's simplify this this one will be a little bit 
hard because we have to uh, multiply x plus a and minus 2 square okay first is y plus b plus 2 plus 2 3 times this one oh no this one is um, x plus a minus 2 this times this first x square this times this plus a x this one negative 2 x and then this one is plus a x this one is plus a square this one is negative 2 a and then this one is negative 2 x this one is negative 2 a and then the last one is plus 4 okay let's simplify it a bit I think I can add this and this yeah, ax plus ax is 2ax so 2ax right here and then this one also negative 4x and then this one also negative 4a yeah. negative 4a so I will have this expression for the x plus x plus a minus b squared okay let's continue this one is negative 25 x negative 25 a plus 50 plus 60 so y plus b plus 2 equals to 3 x square plus 6 a x minus 12 x plus 3 a square minus 12 a Mm, plus 12 minus 25 x minus 25 a plus 110 let's simplify this one mm, this and this negative 37 x negative 37 x and then this and this negative 37 a and then this plus this is 122 122 okay I think that's uh, simple enough for 3x squared plus 6ax minus 37x and then plus 3a squared minus 37a plus 120 because you minus this with 2 um, and then minus p at the back done and because the original is already given which is y equals to 3x square plus 5x plus 6 we can compare to find the value of a and b so this one equals to uh, 5 6ax minus 37 equals to 5 uh, sorry we got x here 6a equals to 42 a equals to 7 and then the next one <coughs> is this one because we already have the value of a let's uh, input it um, directly 7 square minus 37 times 7 plus 120 minus b equals to 6 so 49 times 3 49 times 3 equals to 147 minus 37 times 7 is 259 and then plus 120 minus b equals to 6 147 minus 259 plus 120 equals to 8 minus b equals to 6 so b equals to 8 minus 6 equals to 2 a minus b yeah the question wants you to find the value of a minus b 7 minus 2 equals to 5 D. next is page 170a question number three given the image uh no the image is uh asia so this one is the original uh the line y equals to three is the first transformation and because we have minus a and minus b later in the scheme uh that means we cannot use composition we have to uh calculate it manually starting from the first transformation yeah so the first is y equals to 3 that means x prime y prime equals to y is 
negative uh, 1 times it with the x and y because it's uh, x equals to 3 that means we have to subtract by 3 at the 1 and then next is to multiply t equals to x and then this one is negative y plus 3 and then uh, because we do it twice that means the first thing you have to find is not the x and y but the x prime and y prime yeah x prime equals to x and the y prime is negative y plus 6 okay so we already have the x prime and y prime in term of x and y next is to find the x double prime and y double prime on x equals to 2 yeah so this one is negative 1 0 0 1 and then x and y equals to 2 means this one have to subtract it by 2 sorry this one is x prime y prime here yeah, because we are trying to find the x double prime so x double prime minus 2 y double prime equals 2 this one is um, negative 1 0 0 1 I will leave it like that because I want to replace the x prime first x prime is x and y prime is negative y plus 6 then we still have minus 2 right there okay so x double prime minus 2 y double prime equals 2 um, negative x plus 2 and this one is negative y plus 6 nah at this point uh, baru kita cari x nya ya so x double prime minus 2 equals 2 negative x plus 2 I will move the negative x to the right to the left hand side so it will become x equals to negative x double prime plus 4 and then this one um, y prime y double prime equals to negative y plus 6 when you move it to the left you will have 6 minus negative y double prime plus 6 okay so this is the um, value of x and y it's time for us to find the image we have the original equation which is y equals to x square minus 2x minus 15 minus 2x minus 15 and then to find the image you only have to substitute the y and the x the y is negative y double prime plus 6 equal to the x is negative x double prime plus 4 and then square minus 2 times uh, negative x double prime plus 4 and then minus 15 okay simplify it minus y plus 6 equals to x square minus 8x plus 16 uh, plus 2x minus 8 and then minus 15 negative y equals to x square minus 6x uh, this one is 1 negative 7 negative 6 is negative 13 so y equals to negative x square plus 6x plus 13 negative x square plus 6x plus 13 it's c okay next is page 173a question number 4 so i have the line uh, 2x minus 3y minus 18 equals to 0 this one is the original and then the transformation is translation that means x prime y prime equals to x and y and then plus 5 negative 9 because we have addition in our scheme that means we cannot use composition yeah but we have to uh, calculate it one by one equals to x plus 5 and y minus 9 we have to leave it like this for the first transformation because we still have to find the x double prime x double prime y double prime uh, next is rotation that means cos negative sine sine and cos and then the x and y this one is x prime y prime because we are trying to find the x double prime the a and b is this one a b so minus 4 plus 1 minus 4 and plus 1 and then the angle is 90 degree 90 degree 90 degree 90 degree 90 degree 
Okay, because we already have the x prime and y prime, we can uh, substitute it into the x prime and y prime in this uh, formula. So the x prime is x plus five, the y prime is y minus nine. Okay, so we can simplify it later. Plus one, plus two, cos ninety plus one. Uh, sorry, cos ninety plus two zero. The gas is negative one, one and zero times it with x plus 1 and y minus 8 okay, multiply it so x double prime minus 4 y double prime plus 1 equals to negative y plus 8 and x plus 1 okay from this um, equation I have x double prime minus 4 equals to negative y plus 8 when you move the negative y, it will become y equals to negative x double prime plus 12. <coughs> and then this one, y double prime plus 1 equals to x plus 1. I will move the 1 to the right hand, to the left hand side. So I will have y double prime equals to x. Next is to find the image. <coughs> okay, let me write down the original first. The original is... Um, 2x minus 3y minus 18 equals to 0 to find the image you only have to replace the value of x and y okay x plus x is y double prime and then y is negative x double prime plus 12 that means this is the final image, yeah, not the first image. Already final image. Plus 3x minus 36 minus 18 equals to 0. So 3x plus 2y minus 40, 54 equals to 0. So 3x plus 2y. <coughs> Maybe I uh, type this wrong. So B the x plus the y minus 54. Oh, or maybe this one. This is wrong. So it's D. Next is question number 8. Given that the line 3x minus y equals to negative 2, that means this one is the original. Uh, reflected and then rotation about 0, 0. That means we can use composition. Yeah? X prime, y prime. Sorry, x double prime, y double prime equals 2 just like that okay first is y equals to x y equals to x will be right here y equals to x and then uh, rotation 90 degree <coughs> y equals to x is 0 1 1 0 cos 90 equals to 0 negative sin 90 is negative 1 sin 90 equals to 1 and cos 90 equals to 0 and then you will only have to uh, simplify it 0, negative 1, 1, 0. This one is y and x. And you multiply it one more time. You will have negative x and also y. x double prime and y double prime. So from this one, you will have x equals to negative x prime. And this one, y equals to y double prime. Okay, the original is 3x minus y equals to negative 2. So the image will be 3 times x minus y equals to negative 2. The y is y double prime. The x is negative x double prime. So the image is negative 3x minus y plus 2 equals to 0. You don't have it, so you multiply it with negative 1. 3x plus y minus 2 equals to 0. Okay, so B. The last question, uh, question number 9. Given that the image of the curve after it is uh, Now, the image is us. So this one is the original x-axis, direction, no minus a minus b. That means we can use um, composition. <coughs> okay, so first is x-axis. X-axis 
is um, what is this? Yeah, G1, 0, 0, negative 1. And then scale factor 3, that means um, 3, 0, 0, 3. Okay, multiply. X double prime, Y double prime equals 2. <coughs> 3, 0, 0, 3 times it with X and negative Y. And then x double prime, y double prime equals 2, 3x and negative 3y. From this one, I have x equals 2, sorry, scroll down, 3x, that means x equals 2, 1 over 3x double prime. From this one, y double prime equals 2, negative 3y, that means y equals 2, negative 1 over 3y double prime. Okay, so the original is um, y equals to x square plus 3x plus 3. That means the image is equals to x square plus 3 times x plus 3. Replace the y first, negative 1 over 3 y double time. <coughs> replace the x with 1 over 3 x double prime 1 over 3 x double prime okay so negative 1 over 3 y equals 2 this one is 1 over 9 x square plus uh, cos of this x equals 3 you multiply them all by negative 9 so this one is 3 y yes 3 y equals 2 negative if x square minus 9x minus 27 the answer is b this type again should be b yeah. okay guys that is the solution for your exercise i hope that you can understand it well as usual if you cannot understand some of the explanation you can ask me later yeah? see you guys bye